All right, so in this video, we are going to talk about financing your education at Scalar School of Technology. So let's start. Now let's answer the main question of how will you finance this education, right? So I think everyone should go ahead and while filling the form, ensure that you fill it out in detail so that we can evaluate your profile for scholarships. Scholarships typically are given between 20 to 100% for well-deserving profiles. And how are they given? There are typically five factors that we look at. Number one is your performance in school so far. Uh, number two is uh, extracurriculars. What else have you done? What achievements do you have outside of studies? Number three is performance in competitive exams. Four is family income. And fifth is gen gender. So we look at all of these, give you a score on this, and then decide who gets a scholarship or does not, and how much is the scholarship for. Okay, so that's how that's decided. Now, if you get a scholarship, great. Even if you don't get a scholarship, uh, there are a lot of ways to support you in, in your quest to study at SST, which is where the financing options come in. We've tied up with multiple banks and NBFC partners who have education loans. And because we are very selective in choosing our students, and these banks also have confidence in these students eventually getting jobs, they give out these loans to our students, right? So the way that works is that once you have an offer, your counselor will reach out to you and check if you need financing assistance and then they work with you to connect you to the right partner. So don't worry, if, if you really are passionate about studying computer science, go ahead, clear the NSAT, get an offer and I think we will be there to support you in helping you finance the course. Right. Lastly, I want to end by saying that there are two ways of looking at it. Either you can look at it as an investment or you can look at it as an expenditure. Now, let's say scenario A, you go to a legacy college, uh, typical starting salary, 6 lakhs, 7, 8 lakhs. And uh, let's say that you come to SST and of course, like you have to work hard, you have to be passionate about computer science and let's assume that you start at a 15 lakh per annum salary. Now, now the thing is compounding is a beautiful phenomenon. Like if you start even with a gap of 8 lakhs, if you see the screen right now, if you extrapolate this right over multiple years, you will see that at 10 years, the gap really increases. At 20 years, the gap increases much further. At 40 years, which is your career, the gap will increase much, much further. So net net, getting the right skills is an investment which will pay you uh, a lot. And there is more on top of it, right? Like in your third year, there will be an internship that you will be part of, which will also give you a stipend which you can use to support your education. Uh, you can also do freelance projects that a lot of our students are also doing, which give them money to support their education. So yeah, these are, these are some inputs that I wanted to share with you so that you can be feel more confident about financing your education at Scalar School of Technology. So all the best. I hope to see you all on campus very soon. Thank you so much.